Hello everyone, Happy New Year! Today I will share with you a very new and simple method to install the Google Play services on your Huawei phone, which is compatible with uh, Huawei's Mate 40 Pro and Mate 30 Pro, and uh, Huawei's P40 Pro and P4, P30, and uh, Huawei's Honor series like Honor V30 Pro, and Huawei's Nova series like Nova 6, Nova 7, so which is compatible with all Huawei's uh, EMUI uh, EMUI ROM and Huawei's Magic ROM, so which is very simple and straightforward method. After I tested this method, and I find that this method is a perfect method, which is high efficient on the phone, and it is not a virtual machine. Actually, it installed the Google account on your mobile phone, and uh, you can use this set Google account to log into your Google Play services and install all the uh, Google applications on your mobile on your Huawei mobile phone. Okay, now let's go to my phone. I will show you step by step. Okay, welcome to my phone. So now I will introduce a perfect way to install the Google GMS into your Huawei phone. I want to stress that uh, this way well, works uh, compatible for all Huawei's Mate 30, Mate 40, and P30, P40, and Nova or series, and uh, Honor, Honor V30 Pro, Honors or series. So this is a perfect uh, way to install the Google uh, uh, Google framework and uh, they, this is different with different compared. This is different with the uh, I mean the the uh, virtual machine. This is not a virtual machine. This solution is to install another Google account into your Huawei phone. Then you can use that account to uh, log into your uh, Gmail and log into your Google Google Play service to install all the application you want to use. Okay, and it is a very very straightforward way to install the Google's uh, services. Okay, now I will show you how to step by step to install the Google services on your Huawei mobile phone. Okay, first we want I want to show you check that my uh, phone's uh, uh, EMUI uh, 10.1.0. But uh, I assure you that this solution works for all kinds of uh, EMUI uh, versions, including the newly the newest the newest version of EMUI uh, 11s, which is compatible with uh, EMUI 11s and compatible with all Huawei phones. Okay, now I will go to my desktop. Now, let's have a look, show you uh, in the uh, Huawei's app galleries. You can search the dual space, D-U-A-L, dual space here. You can see this is already in the Huawei's uh, application store. Then, but this is not the latest version and uh, I just suggest you to download from the uh, uh, the website to get the uh, latest version of this uh, dual space. Okay, so I will give you the link down below for you to download the latest version of this uh, dual space. Okay, if you don't want to use the latest version, you can d directly install from the Huawei App Store. Okay, so uh, let's go go back to my desktop. Okay, now go to my browser to visit that said, uh, website. Okay, here is a web link. I will uh, give you the link down below this video to, for you to download the latest version of uh, Dual Space 3.2.7. Okay, so now I will click the uh, download the latest version of 3.2.7. Click this one. Okay. And uh, now click the uh, download to download this uh, application. Okay, this application is not very big, only 10.14 megabyte. Okay, so actually I already downloaded this uh, application here. Okay, now I will uh, open it to install. Install this application to get you a uh, to another suite of uh, the Google account to use this Google account to log in to uh, your Google service. Okay, I will move here, then click this one. Okay, then you some information and you click start. You need to allow all these authorities to click to uh, allow and allow and allow to make it uh, function. Okay. Now, there's some very simple introduction. We let's have a look. It's very simple and straightforward and compatible with your phone 
Okay, so now let's start. Okay, now let's click Google Play Store to log in your Google account. Let's click sign in. Just wait a second, then uh, checking info. Okay, now let's uh, enter our user account, Google uh, Gmail account. Okay, then click next. Then input your password. Okay, we log in and then click agree. I agree. Getting account information. Okay, we uh, switch off the backup to Google Drive. Yeah, and uh, click accept. Okay, perfect. We already log in to the uh, Google account. Then you can uh, install all the application you want. For example, you install the Google Map and uh, you can uh, install the other application you want. Very simple and straightforward. Okay, so you can uh, click this one, Google Map. Then click Install. Then you can uh, install the Google Map on your phone. Okay, now let's go to the desktop again. Then uh, let's have a try because we already uh, logged in the Google Play, Play Store. Then we click YouTube to check the YouTube. Yes, YouTube can be opened and YouTube already logged in with your Google account. And uh, um, it, I mean, this is, I want to stress that this is not, uh, I mean, this is not a uh, virtual machine. This is a... Uh, um, installed another Google account on your mobile phone. So which which means this um, application where can uh, I mean this Google YouTube can communicate with your original Huawei system directly. You can upload your videos, upload your photos to the to your Google's cloud directly. No need to using import and export. So this is a very perfect way to install Google uh, Play Store, the Google services, because there's no need to import and output. You can, uh, uh, you can uh, communicate with your Huawei original phone directly. It's very efficient. Okay, and even you can uh, um, just put this link, put this icon on your shortcut as a shortcut here. Um, but uh, you firstly, you needed to give this authority to uh, put a shortcut. Currently, you can see no shortcut. Then you can uh, using the uh, app to give the app the authority to um, have the uh, shortcut. Yeah, D U. Here, give the authority to the sh shortcut. Let's have a look. Permission here, and the create home shortcut here. Allow. Okay, go back. Then you can put uh, this one at the shortcut. Add. Here, you can see you can open this link directly on your phone. Yes. And uh, for the uh, Gmail, you can uh, also directly to click this Gmail to run it directly. It's very easy and straightforward. If you feel this video is helpful, then you can sum up and uh, subscribe to the channel to avoid missing future updates. See you next time. Bye bye.